This is gonna be a quick video that shows you how to set up live audio reactive effects for your VR chat worlds and clubs using the June shader and audio link. I'll do a brief overview of the VR chat world SDK set up with the audio link prefabs I have in my scene, but I assume most that are interested in this already have a basic idea of how to set it all up initially. If not, just copy everything I have and make sure to link your audio source to your audio link controller. Now, let's add a June shader cube using Unity's toolbar and enable blur on it. I'll do some quick settings to get pink rays on the screen that we can then make audio reactive. But don't worry, the audio reactivity works with everything. We also will only be using the GPU audio link options built into June's UI. But for more advanced users, there is also a script generator in June that lets you control specific variables inside the shader with audio link. While I configure all of the ray settings, I'll mention a few other points of interest. You can customize the audio link settings in its controller to make it more reactive or less reactive, as well as inside June settings. Since I'm just testing, I use the panel prefab in the audio link package and turn the gain up a little bit to help the treble hit the threshold to trigger June. There are also four bands in audio link and June setting for it. Bass, low band, high band, and treble. The song I'm using, from DDR, has a lot of high-pitched beats that I want to sync with my effects, so I'll choose treble. It's best to just experiment. And if, for example, you use a song with a lot of heavy bass, choose bass. I also want to point out that I switched the shader from the default June to the Audio Link June, as Audio Link is not included in the default branch. Don't worry. All your settings are transferable between each and every branch and you won't lose any prog. The audio reactive effects works on avatars as well, but you will have less control over audio link itself as you will only be able to configure June's settings for reactivity. If you want more control and want to bake animations into a keyframe file, you can use the sync tool included in June, but that isn't real time. The benefit of using audio link is how universal it is and how it is reactive to anything thrown at it and is not predetermined or baked. I'm about done configuring the June material, so we are ready to go into play mode and see the result. If you want to test it in Unity, I am using the client simulator from the Creator Companion. It only took me about 10 minutes to get everything up and running. I think it turned out pretty fun, but remember, this is super big and there are hundreds of effects in June and all can be reactive. Walk a lot, 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 walk a